Okay, um, I've been scared to make this video just because there's so many different things. There's so many different, like, layers to this that I feel like I'm not going to be able to explain it right. So I am quitting gymnastics. Um, I know this is probably a big shock to a lot of you. Some of you probably aren't shocked. Some of you probably saw it coming. I think it's also really hard for me making this video because I've gained such a large following from this sport that um, announcing that I'm quitting is just kind of nerve-wracking to me because I know that a lot of people are going to leave. <laughs> this has been one of the hardest decisions I've ever had to make. It's crazy <laughs> that this is happening. It was an emotional roller coaster. It's one thing to know you want to do something. It's a whole separate thing to actually act upon it and make real decisions that actually like there's no going back from. This has been, you know, one of the hardest things I've ever had to do because I've done gymnastics since I was six and it's been my whole life. I moved away from home. I don't live with my family. At times I trained 30 hours a week. I feel like everybody you know, has a time where they feel like they want to quit and that's why I didn't pay attention to it and I thought that I would just get over it and I didn't even want to let myself believe it. So, you know, I just kind of like buried it deep down, but it never really went away. Um, I think I've 100% decided that I want to quit. Um, I've known that I didn't want to do gymnastics for the past, like, I want to say, year. Like, you say that, but then, like, nothing ever happens. You just keep, you just keep going. <laughs> uh, it's like, I love the sport, but I hate doing it at this point. And I hate that I hate doing it, but I just do. And I know, I know that I'm going to be super sad when I quit, but at the same time, like, Everyone's saying like, oh, I just don't want you to regret quitting. I feel like if anything, I'll regret not quitting. There's so much that I want to do in my life. And after, like, gymnastics only lasts for the next four years. Like, after college, you retire, you're done. The stuff that I want to do right now is what I want to do for the rest of my life. And that's not gymnastics. And I feel like I would be wasting time doing that for four years four more years and I'm just ready to move on. People have said like, I started gymnastics because of you and you're the reason why I didn't quit and why I keep going. So I just feel like if I quit, I'm letting all of them down. I feel like I'm letting my younger self down because this is like all I ever wanted for myself. And I guess it's just like confusing that I don't want it anymore. Um, uh, now that it's kind of time to tell people that's the plan, it's scary. It's actually terrifying. That's all for now. Oh my god. Uh, I just texted uh, my coach and said that I wanted to talk with him, with my mom, tomorrow after practice. Um, and we've like never done that before, so he probably knows something's up now. Right when I sent that text, I just got the worst pit in my stomach. Like, I can't even believe that this is like actually happening. Um, it's just like so hard to quit right now just because I feel like I'm a terrible person for quitting. Like, I just feel so guilty. It's just the best thing for me, but for some reason I just feel so selfish. I feel like I'm like, I don't know, I feel bad for quitting my college team. I just feel so guilty. And I, uh, I don't know what, to, I don't know how to deal with this. I just feel like so many people are gonna be so disappointed. I feel like it's normal for gymnasts 
to feel this way because I think a lot of times I felt like I had to go to college and do gymnastics or I was a failure and I failed my life basically you feel so bad about wanting to quit it because you feel like you you have to gymnastics kind of put me through a lot of things mentally you know obviously i was always hurt physically but uh, mentally it really messed with me a lot i constantly felt like i wasn't good enough like trying to post a video of myself doing gymnastics and then going to read the comments and seeing that they thought what i thought made me never want to put on a leo again now that i'm quitting it's made it a lot easier to not let that stuff bother me but this past year year and a half i've kind of learned a lot about myself and um i've grown up a lot and i've learned that there is so much more to life than gymnastics <laughs> and um my whole childhood gymnastics was just the only thing and i'm only on this earth for you know limited amount of time so now there's so many things that i want to do in my life like so many things that i want to explore and that i want to do while i'm young and um yeah i just want to have fun oh this is so difficult i don't know what i'm saying um i told my closest friends and my parents and nobody else and then we just kind of sat on it i i was too scared to make any further motion um and then season was coming up and I knew that with season coming up and I'm a senior and I would have been going to Alabama this year and we would have had to start setting up dorms and all that stuff and I told my coach early January and I called the head coach at Alabama um a week later I thought that I would leave those conversations feeling crushed, but I honestly had the biggest weight off of my shoulders. I felt like a million pounds lighter <laughs> after just getting it out. And I think that to me was a sign that I was making the right decision. Bye. Bye. You did it! You're sad? Why are you sad? That was so sad. But she was really, really sweet and so supportive of you. I worked my whole life for that. I just gave it up. <laughs> hey! 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 <laughs> Woo! Oh my god, that was awful. I was shaking the whole I time. Know. I, was like, I had to stand up and like I do know, a lap. I, I <laughs> She was like, what's up? And I was like, oh yeah, so anyway. <laughs> I, I was <laughs> said, so I just want to tell you about <laughs> I was like, oh no, no, no. I am finishing the season and I will be posting all of my meets for the rest of this season. I am sorry for the delay. I do have an issue making gymnastics videos. It's been very bad for my self-esteem. A lot of people ask why I don't post gymnastics videos anymore, but that's why. I hate how people see me when I post videos like that there's a lot of creeps just like disgusting people and then there's also just me <laughs> so creeps and me basically i just like can't with the gymnastics videos but we i will get them to you i'm sorry for putting those off so don't leave yet <laughs> um i feel good about my gymnastics career I don't feel like I need to do it any longer. Gymnastics has already taken up so much of my life and as amazing as college gymnastics is, I just feel like I don't want gymnastics to take up any more time in my life because I want to try so many things. You know, right now I'm super into music and that is something that is so important to me. I really am grateful for music because it is one of the things that kind of helped me realize that like, Gymnastics isn't the only thing that can give you purpose. And um, I just love it. And I don't love gymnastics like that anymore. And who knows, I may there may come a day when I will get sick of music. And when that day comes, great. But right now I'm focusing on what I want right now. And 
this is what I want. You no, know, I've always been into film. I love editing, directing, and I've always been super big into film. Obviously, I want to keep posting on YouTube. You know, acting, graphic design, photographer, the the options are endless. And I think I will always love gymnastics. It will always be my first love and I will always appreciate the life it's given me and um, like what it did, like it shaped me as a person. I do wanna say sorry to all of the people that I had to lie to. Multiple people came up and asked me if I was still gonna do gymnastics in college and I said yes because I didn't know what to say and I didn't want it getting out and I didn't want people to know yet. And yeah, I did lie, I lied and I wanna apologize to all of the um, peers and fans that I've lied to when you uh, see me in person, but um, I hope you can understand that I just didn't want rumors and um, I wanted everyone to find out like this. I do understand that a lot of people will unfollow and leave and that's okay i completely understand that most people follow me for gymnastics and if i'm not doing that anymore then they will leave <laughs> i hope some people stay but you know um it is what it is i think at this point in my life i'm only focusing on me and what i want <laughs> not my past self not my future self but me right now. It was official that I was quitting back in January and it is now March, end of March. I still don't regret a thing. I'm excited. We'll see what happens. Life is crazy. Life is a roller coaster. Stream older. <laughs> yeah, now that I'm making this video, I am really excited. I'm hopeful and um, I can't wait for what the future holds. I am so grateful for what the sport has given me. It's giving me my best friends. I wouldn't be the person I am today without gymnastics. I think it's an incredible sport. The skills that it teaches you, not only physically, you can do amazing things, but mentally, it really shapes you into a person. And, um, you know, the platform it's given me and the opportunities from the sport has just been incredible and i wouldn't i wouldn't trade it for anything i'm so grateful for the sport and i will always love it you know maybe in another life i ended up going to college and competing and i hope she's doing well i think all good things come to an end at some point and this is my end for my gymnastics career i've been trying not to cry this whole video so i'm not going to i'm sure i have more to say but that's all i can think of right now i hope i got things across okay and um i love you guys so much and have a great day yolo